Hi, in this second tutorial about widget presets in Qt Sound, I'm going to show how to control the presets from the widget panel itself through channels. So um, I'm going to show you we, we had the same presets as before, just a maxed out one and a minimum one. Those are our two presets. I'm going to do a small section here in the widget panel for the presets. So I'll just bring a, one of these boxes down here. I'm going to create a new scroll number. This scroll number will send uh, the preset uh, index I want to change using a reserved channel. Its name is set preset index. This is a Qt Sound reserved channel. So if you use this, Qt Sound will receive it and uh, set the preset by index. I've got only two presets. So the minimum index is zero, and since I only have uh, two, the other is one. And I'll set the resolution to one, so that we have only integers. So now if I move it, you can see I'm jumping between the two presets. So this is a way to send uh, a value to change uh, the, the presets. I can also use the reserve channel set preset, but this time, since the numbers are one and two, I need to use those numbers. So you can see that now I change with one and two. If you remember, these are the numbers. So in this case, number one has index zero and number two has index one. Another useful thing to do with presets is uh, receive the number of the currently active preset. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to create a new display which will show me the preset name. To do that, I will use another reserve channel called get preset name. And let's make it the font a bit bigger. Let's give it a border, that's fine. Let's make it a bit bigger. So now when I move this, you will see that that display box is receiving the name of the preset. Okay, so it's a fairly straightforward system. I'll see you in the next one.